Architecture in Second Life is a lot modern and futuristic. The shapes of the buildings, the constructive elements, fits our imagination and makes us feel free to design. The color in architecture help us to define spaces, give us feelings of coolness and warmth, depending on the case, and we cannot forget that colors evoke feelings that are important when we think about the function to be held in that environment. The illumination makes us feel things. It can make us feel safe and comfortable, or irritating at times, depending on the light of the space where we are. It helps us to enjoy the potential of that place. It can create a st stimulating or relaxing area, depending on the intensity of the light that we use. And also, we can treat it with perforated talents. And I will talk about the relationship between the program Second Life and urban planning. Second Life is an early virtual world where the people can explore, share, participate in activities, create and exchange things. Here I will show you factors where this and urban planning are related. This image is from Venice in the program Second Life. The rhythm in this image is mostly influenced by this look of old that is highlighted by the light of the sun. Another factor in the rhythm is the picture is the height, because it's the same in the most of the buildings. Also, another factor is the exterior design of the building because all share the same Venetian style. The architectural concepts are conceived in Second Life mostly when you're going to create something. That the program shows you all the figures, measures, and options to create whatever that you have in mind. I have chosen the classical Greek architecture, including that of the Cyclotic Island and the ancient city of Babylon, to exemplify and explain eight important elements in architecture, which are color, light, texture, rhythm, vertical and horizontal circulation, and space and scale. Since many of the places I chose no longer exist, or only the ruins remain, I visited them in Second Life. That way I got a better idea of how it felt to be in those incredible sites. 